Marcus, this, this board is a dugout flat water. Tell me about how you designed this. Um, yeah, so this is another dugout uh, for the same reason, basically for stability. Um, I wanted to go as skinny as possible, so I want to be as stable as possible. So we sink the deck into a dugout and um, yeah, we. I'm riding this at 22 wide, no worries. Um, super stable, super fast. So that lower center of gravity offsets that narrow, narrow size with stability. Yeah, you, you, the deck of this is about 75 mil from the bottom of the board, whereas on a flat deck you're at about probably double that. So you're so much lower. You're lower to your power source as well, so it's, there's two benefits to it. Definitely. Now you do a lot of flat water racing. Yes. This board is flat water versus a, you know, regular deck board. This thing is as fast as you could want any board to be. And uh, one of the other beauties of this is, if you ride a 27 inch board, then the 25, the stability in this would suit you. If you ride a 25 now, you could ride the 23 and a half easily. Um, I just raced at Scott's Head and it was mild ocean conditions with the chop, uh, slight upwind, slight downwind, 23 and a half, and it was perfectly. So, it is versatile, it can handle small conditions, but in the flat, it's, it's just a rocket. Marcus, this board has the Venturis on the side for the drain. How do they work? Uh, yep, so basically it creates a little low pressure point behind the Venturi on the side, which just basically sucks the water out. You can actually hear them suck when you paddle. Um, it's great for if you take a wave over the front, which you wouldn't usually in this board, but it will drain water super quick. Now, construction on this is the Sonova Balsa construction. Uh, how does this how does this construction work? Because it's got the, the fine lines through it. Um, it's not just regular, just slap on balsa. No, I tell you um, secrets, John. <laughs> so the balsa you see with the black lines is uh, the balsa's scored, and those black lines are actually resin, um, and it stiffens up every point of this balsa you see is stiffer than just the balsa if it didn't have that line so it's like little ridges I guess in every little uh, panel uh, how, Im balsa. how important is the stiffness of a board in racing? Oh very important especially in the flat water you know that stiffness uh, equates to power and drive so it's uh, yeah it's really important and if you if you look on the bottom you'll notice uh, that they, that we don't uh, have the ridges and that's uh, to do with the flex memory of the balsa. It just allows just the, every little fine little bit of movement in the board, uh, its memory is super fast so it allows that extra glide and it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty special stuff.